Hey guys and welcome or welcome back. So today we're gonna be packing and prepping to go to New York City. I am so excited. I love the city during the Christmas time. It's just like the best. So I'm going with my boyfriend and we're only going for one night, but I wanna plan some cute outfits. And I'm really hoping I can fit everything into my tote bag because I don't wanna be carrying bags around the city. So the only prepping I did earlier today was go to my nail appointment. I absolutely love them. They look so good. The shape and the chrome powder is just so pretty. I'm so happy with how they turned out but now I want to focus on packing and picking out outfits so I made a rough itinerary of like some things we want to do so tomorrow I'm thinking I only need two outfits one to travel with and then one for dinner and then Thursday I think I only need one outfit we'll see but I already started picking out one outfit for dinner so let me show you guys that so here's the outfit I actually got this jacket for my birthday and I never got the chance to wear it but it's this like light leather trench from forever 21. It's so cute on. And then with it, I'm thinking this little leather skirt with some tights, this scarf, which you can't really see. It's like a blanket scarf. And then probably a turtleneck. And then worst case, if I don't like the turtleneck idea, I have this button up top. So that would be option number two. And then for shoes, I'm thinking these boots, they're like mid calf boots and they're so comfortable to walk in. So I'm definitely going to bring these with me. And then for traveling, I'm thinking just a black long sleeve and these like cargo pants that I have from ASOS. They're a light denim, but they are so comfortable. I love these pants. So these are definitely coming with me. So I think I'm all done with outfits. I'm bringing those pants that I just showed you guys. And then this is just a black long sleeve bodysuit. And then I'm debating between these two sweat sets. They're both good options. And I'm probably gonna wear them with my black leather puffer, but I just really need to decide which one I wanna bring. And then of course the dinner outfit is definitely coming with me. And then for shoes, I'm bringing the boots that I showed you guys. And then my platform Converse. I love these shoes and they're really comfortable to walk in. So I think we're all done with outfits. And now I wanna move on to packing toiletries and like all my accessories. So I actually stopped by Target and Ulta and I want to show you guys quickly what I got for the trip. So starting from Ulta, I got some stuff to straighten my hair because I'm hoping I could straighten my hair tonight before we leave tomorrow. It's going to take a while, but I feel like it'll just be a lot easier and then that way I won't have to bring all my curly hair products. So I just got some Iron Guard because I don't have any heat protectant and then I got these crop clips. So that way when I do my makeup, my hair won't get in my face. So I'm really excited to try those. And then the last thing I got from Ulta is this lip liner. It's this NYX one and it's in the shade cold brew i think where's the name yeah it's cold brew and i just needed one that's a little more brown because i have nude truffle and it's just a little too pink so i'm really excited to try this i saw people on tiktok trying it and it looked good on everyone so then moving on to target i got a new sd card because i only have one and it's only 32 gigabyte so i decided to get 128 gigabyte one just to have a backup and i could fit more on it so yeah, I got a 128 gigabyte one. And then I got a new eyelash curler because the cushion in mine is broken and it's like hurting my eyes. So it was definitely time for a new one. And then the last thing I got is a new spoolie. And this is the e.l.f. one that has the brow lift applicator on it. I actually don't have the brow lift. I have the soap brow from e.l.f. But I feel like it'll work just as good, especially with just like laying down the brows. So all of this is definitely coming with me. And now I want to move on to packing my makeup. And I guess update while I'm packing i started using blush in my makeup routine and i love how it looks i don't know why i was so opposed to it but for cream blush i used this nyx sweet cheeks blush mousse and it's so pretty and so natural this is the shade i think it's nude tude i think it should be nude tude and then for powder blush on top of that i used the elf blush in always rosy and i really like this one too it's not like too pink so i'm just gonna finish packing this and also charge my camera battery because it's blinking at me and then i will catch up with you guys once i'm done packing my makeup. So I charged my battery, we're all good, and my dad bought me a matcha. I've been on a matcha kick recently. I'm really tired today, so hopefully that helps. But somehow, some way, I was able to get all my stuff into the bag, including my shoes and that leather trench coat. So I cannot believe it, but I did it. The only thing I have left to pack are like my chargers and then my jewelry. But honestly, this is the bag that I'm gonna be bringing to like walk around. So I'm thinking it'll all fit in here. The chargers I could definitely sneak in here, but I 
think I really just don't want to straighten my hair. Like I do for the look, but it just takes so long. I think I'll pack my jewelry just so I could like officially be done with the bag. And so I don't forget it in the morning because I did that last time and I was so upset. Hey guys, so I just got out of the shower and I washed my hair and it's pretty much dry. So I'm ready to straighten it. And I think I'm just going to watch some Vlogmas videos while I do this. But right now it is 9.25 and I want to see how long this takes me. So I will update you guys when I'm done. I'm thinking honestly probably midnight. But let's hope it doesn't take that long. I'm one hour in and it's gonna be a long night. It's done. <laughs> Hey guys, so as you saw, I finished a little after 12 and right now it is 12.52, it's pretty late. But I decided I'm gonna wear the brown sweat set and then this is the leather puffer that I'm gonna wear. I really like it and it's really warm too, so that'll be really good. I need to get to bed because we're leaving pretty early tomorrow. We're going to New York. Well, New York City, because I am in New York. Look at the view. It's actually really nice. I wish we were a little higher up, but this is nice. Hey guys, so we just got here and right now I'm just getting ready because we're gonna head out to Soho to do some shopping. And then once we're done shopping, I wanna go to Rowie's. I've seen it all over TikTok. They have a really good happy hour special. They have like personal margarita pies and rosemary spritzes. So we're gonna head over there. So we just finished shopping in Soho. I ended up getting some chocolates for my parents. This is their favorite chocolate shop and they closed all the ones by our house. So I'm really excited to give this to them, but right now we're heading over to Rowie's to go eat some pizza. We got cake from this place called, I think it's pronounced Harbs, Harbs, Arbs, Arbs. But we got the queen of cake, hopefully you could see that. But it's like a strawberry sponge cake with fresh whipped cream and fresh strawberries. I'm really excited for this. We had it last time we came here and it was really good. So we ended up going to Rowie's. How'd you like it? I would give it a 8.5. I would give it like an eight or nine. I actually really liked it. I didn't get the rosemary spritz. I ended up getting this hot toddy drink. And even though it said hot, I thought it would be iced, but it actually was like a hot drink. Honestly, I would go back. The pizza was really, really good. They had toppings. Yeah, they didn't have many options for toppings. They only had like a few. They didn't have a lot of meat options. But we're just gonna relax, probably eat the cake. She is stunning. I will be missed. Especially this view.